Hey there everybody, how you doing? I am Francis and welcome back to Pokemon Yellow. In the last episode, we went through the Digwitz Cave here and we ended up uh, being here. We cut uh, this tree down and we explored and we found out that we're basically back to Peter City. So, we basically went full circle and we're back uh, where we began. And today we're just going to see what's uh, down here. Well, there ain't much uh, down here, but we'll still check out the rest of this uh, path uh, down this way. So, let's uh, get going. There's a house down here. This person probably doesn't get much visitors since, you know, they're in an isolated part of town. A fainted Pokemon can't fight, but it can still use moves like Cut. Yes, I've noticed and I'm very thankful for that. I could get softlocked if my fainted Pokemon couldn't use Cut anymore. I'm looking for a Clefairy. Wanna trade one for Mr. Mime? Kid, I would love to, but the problem is I don't have a Clefairy. I'm very sorry, I wouldn't mind making this trade, but I don't have a Clefairy and I don't really want to go back to Mount Moon and hope that I find one. Because I've already been to Mount Moon, it's a long place, and we didn't find a Mr. Mime last time. Or not Mr. Mime, a Clefairy. We found all Zubats and Geodude, but no Clefairy. And I'm not really planning on hunting for one. Oh, hello. Once a Pokemon learns Flash, you can get through Rock Tunnel. Where is Rock Tunnel? Oh, it's way over there. Where is it? Oh, I gotta get back to Sierra Leone City. Okay. And I have to go down that way to get to Rock Tunnel. Okay. But I need Flash first. Hey, dude. Hi, right, remember me? I'm Professor Oak's aide. If you caught 10 kinds of Pokemon, I'm supposed to give you an HMO5, which is the Flash we were just told about, and we did hear that we need that to get through Rock Tunnel, so... You are a blessing. So, have you caught at least 10 kinds of Pokemon? I done better than that. I done double that, sir. I got 20. Great, you have caught 21. Oh, sorry, 21. My mistake. 21 kinds of Pokemon. Congratulations. Here you go. I got HM5. The HM flashlights, even the darkest dungeons. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, I'm gonna need that for Rock Tunnel, like we were told, so let's, uh, use that. Teach Flash to a Pokemon? Sure. Oh, well, only a Pikachu can use it. No one else on my team right now. Alright, screw it, I'm doing it. Yeah, I'll delete an order move to make move for Flash. So what should be forgotten? Uh, goodbye, Double Team, I don't need you. Alright, Pikachu Learn Flash, which in battle I believe can blind your opponents. Or do something that makes that uh, drops their accuracy, but uh, using it on uh, dungeons lights up the room, so that's cool. Hey, we got an HP up. Let's uh, use that. Oh, not HM5. I'll have to get rid of that. Alright, who needs more HP? Uh, I'll give it to Squirtle. Yeah. And I got Moonstone! Cool! Let's keep going down till we can't go down no more. Okay, we can't go down no more. Alright, well... We gotta get back to Sierra Leone City. Um, I don't really want to go through Mount Moon and Pewter City though. So what I'm going to do is... We're gonna go back the way I came to get here. Which means I am gonna be going through, uh... I am gonna be going through, uh, the... Digwood's cave again. Alright, you can do cut to get... Cut that tree down. Because I'm going back, like I said, the way I came. It'd be a lot faster that way. Alright, off we go. Let's go. Whoop, bow time. Oh, well, we know there's Digwood's in here. Hello, Digwood. Go, Bubasaur. Well, Bubasaur is not staying. We're getting Charmeleon out here. Who's going to give you a world of pain. Oh, Scratch. Okay. Cut! Ooh, Charmeleon, you are great. Nice. Although, like I said, Gyarados is my favorite Pokemon. I'm probably going to be using him more now. Now that we got him, you know. 
Plus, he's kind of immune to dig, so that's great. Yeah, let's get him out here. He already has most of the amount of HP over everyone else. Oh, you're gonna growl at me? How adorable. Sorry, but you're just a... You're just a digwit. You're not that intimidating. I'm not intimidated at all by you. Bye-bye. Nice. That's how things get... Oh, come on! I just took four steps, man! Just four steps! Alright, guys. Uh, here's uh, what we're going to be doing. You guys don't need to see this uh, whole trip back. So, yeah. I'm going to cut out after I beat this digwit. And I'll be back you guys when we get back to Sierra Leone City. So, I'll see you guys then, alright? Alright, see you guys. Oh, uh, welcome back, guys. Uh, we haven't left the uh, Digwit's cave yet, but... We interrupt this uh, journey back to, per to show that Bulbasaur is evolving! We now have an Ivysaur! Yeah! Alright, well, that was exciting. Now I'll see you guys uh, once again when we get back to... Uh, when we get back to Sierra Leone City. Ooh, it's a duck trio. Oh, we gotta capture this. We gotta capture this, guys. We gotta do this. All right. Gyarados, I know you will not kill it. You'll be immune to dig, which is why I'm summoning you. But yeah, we gotta capture this, guys. We gotta do it. All right, did some good damage. Just gonna keep tackling it a couple more times. Alright, tackle again. Okay, it's digging a hole. That's fine. I'm immune to your digging. What? I missed! Oh boy. Yeah, I'm in a world of pain right now. Okay, a critical hit. Maybe one... No, I'm gonna try capturing it. Pokeball, you do your thing. Damn! It broke free! Alright, let's tackle it one more time then. Don't kill it, don't kill it, don't kill it. Thank you, okay. Now we'll try and capture it. Yeah! We got Dug Trio, guys! I can't wait to never use it, but we got it! Exciting! A team of triplets that can burrow over 60 miles per hour, okay. Due to this, some people think it's an earthquake. Well... Seeing how fast they can dig, I can believe that. Alright. Well, we finally got through uh, Diglett's cave, so that's exciting. But we have to do some backtracking to get back to Sierra Leone City. Guys, uh, welcome back. We have made it back to Sierra Leone City. Uh, we're gonna have you cut this uh, little branch down. And while we're here, we can go uh, to the bike shop and uh, get ourselves a bike since we still have uh, that bike uh, vulture or vulture or whatever it is. Where was the bike shop again, though? Was it here? Yeah, okay. Hey, dude. Oh, that's a bike vulture. Okay, here you go. And now I got a bicycle. Yay! Now we can move faster. A plain city bike is good enough for me. You can't put a shopping basket on an MTB. Like I said before, I'm going to pretend I know what that is. Which I kind of don't. Being totally honest with you guys. Uh, I had to get through that host though to get into the back. Okay. Alrighty. Yeah, last time we went down, but this time we can go this way. Because we can cut this. 
Oopsie. I need you to cut. Thank you. And now we can continue our adventure and we got more trainers to fight. Alright, cool. You have Pokemon with you. You're mine. Or maybe it's you who is mine. Either way, your Pokemon are going to be obliterated and you're going to love it. An Oddish? Oddish. Really? That's the one you want to say though against me? <laughs> okay. You and your adorable plant will meet my personal flamethrower. Wow, that 2 HP is really going to help you. <laughs> Not really, I'm going to burn you. Like That's how I play Pokemon games. I discover your weakness and I exploit that weakness. Oh, paralyzing me? Okay, while well, you're hurt by the burn. Enjoy the burn. I can take care of the paralyzing. I got these. Yeah! I'm sure that 2 HP is really gonna help you. Yeah. Oop. And now we can finish you off. Yeah, that's a bit longer than I anticipated, but there you go. A boat to use Bellsprout. Will I change Pokemon? Nah. Charmillion, you got this, bro. Cut that plant to size. Ooh, it's still alive. Okay. Poison! You know what? I'll take care of poison later. For now, we're just gonna burn you down. About to use Oddish! Will I change? Yeah, sure. Let's get uh, my boy Gyarados out here. Yeah! Big bad Gyarados! Gonna bite, bite a, take a big bite out of that plant. Yeah, sucking some help on me. I'm not even phased by that. Goodbye. Thanks for coming. About to use a boss, bro. Eh, yeah, we'll get Charmeleon back out to finish it off. Ember! Ooh! You gotta love it when you get the critical and super effective hit! Haha! <laughs> Overkilled, really? You deceived me! I didn't deceive you, you picked a fight with me. Because I have Pokemon, I, w I really wasn't uh, deceiving you. You notice I have Pokemon? You decided to pick a fight with me because I have Pokemon claiming that uh, I'm yours. And this is where we got to, so... Yeah, sure, let's say I deceived you. TM30, what does that teach me? Contains teleport! I have no one that can use that yet! I need to get, get myself a psychic! Hello. Whoa! <laughs> Great, I was bored! Oh, okay. Hiker wants to fight, huh? Alright, you and your machop. I'm ready for ya. I'm going to get Charmaine out know, to do his whole digging thing that he is so great at. Low kick. Okay, dig. You missed. Nice. Oh, here comes another low kick. Oh boy. Dig again. We're just going to be digging holes. Doing more than just digging a hole, though I'm digging this thing's grave. Because I defeated it. Uh, about to use Onyx! Now nah, I'm not gonna switch! Dig! Ooh! Critical, super effective hit! Nice! I didn't think Dig was gonna be that great against Onyx, but it was. And I have defeated the hiker. Keep it coming, eh? Oh wait, uh, I'm out of Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, you only had two, mate. <laughs> okay. That was actually pretty good, though. Alright, there's a guy up here. What's this sign gotta say? Road 9, Zealand City to Rock Tunnel. Okay. 
Is this the way to a rock tunnel then? Oh, hello. I aim to be the ultimate trainer. Well, I'm already more ultimate than you. Sorry, kid, you got a long way to go. You and your one Pokemon. You're level 24 uh, Sandshrew, which 24 is not really that bad a level. Alright, here's what we're going to be doing. Leech Seed in you. We're going to seed you. Fisher, I'm unaffected by that. Okay. That sounds like it would have been ba bad though if it hit. Fine with it. Ooh, super effective hits. Keep going, Ivysaur. Fine with again. You can take this thing on your own. Oh, at least he's going to finish it. Yeah, Fisher sounds like it would be bad, but it doesn't do what it's supposed to do, which I think is an instant kill attack. You put a lot of stock in uh, Fisher being the one to take me out without even laying a finger on me. Like, Ivysaur is unaffected. My sense through it lost? That's impossible! No, it's very much possible. I'm sorry. I got up early every day to raise my Pokemon from cocoons. Okay, you're another bug hunter. Okay, we haven't seen one of you in quite some time. I thought we were past the bug hunters. Apparently, that's not the case, though. You're never past the bug hunters. Hey, Beedrill! Cool! Like, when it comes to Butterfree or Beedrill, I always like Beedrill more. Although, I'm not really one that uses bug types. I just use the uh, Butterfree really to get past the... Uh, to get past Brock. Because I knew Pikachu would not be very helpful. Focus energy failed. Well, I'm going to cut you down to size and that was your only shot, really. Hey! Level 18 Ivysaur! I'm about to use an RB drill! Yeah, sure, I'll get Squirtle out so he can get some experience. Hi, what's up? Squirtle's not staying. Charmian's coming right back out. Oh, focusing your energy? That's not gonna help you, man. Because I'm gonna use some embers on you. Ooh, it's still alive. Focus energy, which failed, and I'm gonna cut ya! Bye, Beedrill! Squirtle levels it! Level 13! Excellent! And I beat the bug catcher! What? What a total waste of time! Yeah, you wasted my time. And your time as well. You should be training your Pokemon instead of picking fights with uh, random kids that walk by. Just saying. Oh, I'm back where I began. Okay. I want to see if there's anything worth catching in that uh, field of grass that I just uh, jumped through, though. So let's check it out. Let's see what there is. Oh, Nidoran. I think I already have Nidorans, don't I? Like both uh, male and female? I think I do. Either way, I'm going to take it out. Nice! Alright! I'm going to assume there's nothing really worth catching now, so we're just going to move on, alright? Let's go down here. Alright, before I go down that way, I'm going to see what's up here. I don't want to miss out on anything, you know? My super bug Pokemon. Another bug catcher? Freaking really? I thought we were past this. Especially fighting Caterpies and Metapods. I thought we were way past that. Oh, I'm going to make a little bug squirm. Beware my Gyarados. It's the same level as you, but it's more terrifying. And don't worry, he won't have a splash for long. Once I can unlearn it, I will. Is this something he knew from when he was uh, a wee little Magikarp? Hey, Squirtle levels up. 
Nice. About to use Weedle? No, I'm not changing my Pokemon. This is gonna be all Gyarados. These Pokemon have to know true fear and true pain. String shot me all you want. Slow me down, you're still gonna die, man. Yeah, you couldn't even poison me. How pathetic. Venonat? That's a new one. I haven't seen you! Oh, I'm confused. Oh, shit. Oh, no! You're making me hurt myself! How dare! Okay. Uh, Charmeleon, come back out. My Gyarados is too confused to do this. Disable? It failed. Well, you're gonna burn. You'd rather be set on fire than to be eaten by a Gyarados. Or rather bitten. He doesn't eat you for whole, he just, uh, takes a big bite out of ya. But yeah, you rather burn. I think I'd rather be bitten than to be burned. Cause... Being burned sounds a lot more painful. Oh, hello. I'm t I'm taking Reptile to go to Lavender! Oh boy, yeah, Lavender Town's coming up, oh boy! Y'all know about that place. <laughs> Hello, Renata. I got a Squirtle. He's not going to be staying out because he's not that strong right now, unfortunately. But I got a Gyarados. He'll stay out. And he's going to take a bite. Oh, yeah. Oh, quick attack. Please don't be doing that. Ooh. Start with the quick attack, man! I'm just gonna keep biting! About to use Digwit. Uh, I'll keep Gyarados in then, because if it digs, I'm gonna be unfazed. Growling. That's more adorable than terrifying when it comes to you, little Digwit. Oh, you're already dead! <laughs> that was his only move, was to, bu was to take a growl at me. About to use Ekans! Yeah, I'll switch. Yeah, it's been a while, Pikachu. You get out here. Thunder! Thunderbolt! I almost said Thundershock, but no, Thunderbolt. Cool! Good job, Pikachu. About to use Sandshrew! Yeah, I'll get you back out here. All right, Charmeleon, dig! Dig like you've never dug before! Sensory Slash has missed. Oh, it's not gonna miss this time, because I'm... I'm immersed from my hole. Dig again! You're dead. Although, I will have to heal. I got a Super Potions, though, so I should be fine. I defeat the Junior Trainer! Can't measure up! <laughs> I told you, there's none better than me. I know I sound a little bit arrogant and overconfident saying that, but it, it's the truth right now. They sound too good. I'm just a better Pokemon trainer. Oh, a little grass area up here. Is there anything special up here? Anything worth my time to fight or capture? I'll go at least uh, two fights up here. Just to see. Oh, hello. A Neo Arena. Okay, you are worth my time to catch. Go, Gyarados. You're gonna tackle it a couple times and then I'm gonna capture it, alright? This is how we're gonna be doing things. Alright. It's, it's a tackling fight right now. <laughs> Who can tackle the hardest? Well, obviously the giant, the giant uh, sea dragon does. All right, let's see if I can capture you, or if I have to hit you a little bit more. I don't think Gyarados can hit you again, though, without killing you. So that's a little concern of mine, but we're gonna try it. 
Okay, you're still alive. Great. Now we're gonna capture you. Pokeball, go! Yeah! Accept your fate. You're mine. You Pokedex entry at it. Nice. While resting deep in its burrow, its thorns always retract. This is proof that it is relaxed. Oh, okay, so it has its thorns out when it's uh, relaxed. Okay. Good to know. Alright, well, we're gonna see if there's anything else up here. Before I move on. Oop, now time. Ah, uh, just a standard needle ran. You're not really worth my time. I think Squirrel can finish you off on his own. Go Bubble Beam! Oh, dear. Okay, that did some good damage. Try again. Gonna slow you down to the speed of a turtle, which is ironic because I am a turtle. Oh, double kicking. Well, kick me all you want. My bubbles will win in the end. Good job, Squirtle. We're proud of you. Alright, let's move on. Now, my question is, should I go up there? Or should I go take the path down below? I'm going to take the path down below first. Hi. <laughs> Come on, dude! Why do you sound evil? Like, just laughing in a kid's face like that. Alright, deal, dude. Squirtle? I think you'll be great against this, so we're gonna start with some bubble beams, slow you down, and be, get a super effective hit in. <gasps> Ooh, you killed it! Good job, Squirtle! I didn't know you had that in you! I'm proud of you, little guy! Alright! But to you, Zonix, yeah, you stay up. Can you go for two for two? We're gonna find out! Because here comes a bubble beam. Uh oh, it's tackling. Okay, that didn't do a lot of damage. I think we got it! I am proud of my little Squirtle. I love this guy. Ooh, level 16. I think that's all that's needed to evolve, so that's cool. We're gonna get a War Turtle. <laughs> you beat me fair, kid. Thank you for the money. Yep, Squirtle is evolving. Yeah. And there we go. We got our War Turtle. Nice. Kill. All right. I'm going to keep you in my lead, actually, because I want you to get uh, close to Ivysaur's level. All right, so there ain't much uh, down that way, so... I'm glad we at least fought that guy, so... That's all the way. I beat you already, right, right? Yeah, if you don't like bug Pokemon, you bug me. Oh, well, sorry to bug you, but yeah, I don't like bug Pokemon. They're just kind of weak, you know? <laughs> Aren't you a little toughy? Um, did you not see the other people I was uh, beating up? So, yeah, I know I'm a toughy. Let's do this. Geo dude, huh? Well, War Turtle, you know what to do. You do your thing. The thing that you do oh so well. Nice. Yeah, level 17. Not bad. Bow to use my chop. Yeah, I'll switch. Let me get my Gyarados back out. It's been a while since he had some fun in the sun. And he's my favorite Pokemon, you know? Take a big bite out of that Machop. Big bite of his muscles. His muscles are nothing against the uh, mighty sea dragon. Uh, about to use Geo, dude. Will I switch? Nah. You can take a big bite out of this rock. Your your fangs are strong enough to pick, take a bite out of a rock. Okay, maybe not. All right. We'll do it this way then. Get War Turtle back out to do this. I need to learn water moves for Gyarados. Too bad all my water moves I taught to this little guy. But it's okay. He's pretty cool. Now I defeat the hiker. 
Not bad. What's that? That that that's how you lose. <laughs> Kids should be tough. Well, I am. I was tough enough to be you. Oh, hello. Don't you dare condescend me! Well, you're picking a fight with me. I'll be as condescending as I want, okay? What are you gonna send out like me? A meowth? Okay. Well, meowth, meet my friend Charmeleon. Payday! Coins are scattered everywhere. Well, I'm gonna throw you. Throw you across the battlefield. And Charmeleon is big and strong. He can throw you pretty far. And that's your counter? You're gonna growl at me? Aren't you adorable? I'm gonna dig. Goodbye! And I defeated the junior trainer. What do you gotta say? No, you're too much! Hey, I got 46 uh, Poké Dollars out of that. Thank you for using Payday. It really helped me out. Alright, we are here now. Kill. What's here in the grass? Hey, I don't have a shop, do I? Okay. We're turtle. I'm counting on you not to kill this thing, okay? We're gonna do one bubble beam. It should not die. Yeah, okay. And then next turn, we're gonna tackle it. And then we're gonna use our Pokeball, okay? Maybe one more tackle. Oh dear, you're low on health, okay. Okay, one more tackle. Yep. Uh, you're dead, aren't you? Yep. Yep, you're- Nope, you're, you're still alive, okay! Uh... I don't trust one Pokeball to work, so we're just gonna heal you up right now, okay? And now we're gonna send out that Pokeball. Pokeball go! Accept your home, Machop, yeah! Yeah! New Pokedex entry was added. Very powerful in spite of its small size, its mastery of many types of martial arts make it very tough. Do you want to give a nickname to your Machop? No, not really. Alright! Let's see what else we got here. Hey, Magnemite! Well, I'm gonna—I'm not gonna be keeping a uh, War Turtle in, <laughs> or sending out Gyarados. That'd be dumb. They're both War Pokemon, and that thing's well—it's a big ball of electricity. <laughs> we'll get uh, <laughs> we'll get Pikachu out here. Thunder on Thunder! I'm not worried about Pikachu dying against it. All right, you got tackle. I'm going to start off with Flash. It failed. Okay, I don't think it's gonna work on this thing. Alright, that's fine. Slam! Ooh, that did some good damage. Okay. I'm gonna do a quick attack. Shouldn't kill it, but do enough damage so that I can capture it. Alright. Get right, Magnemite. You are mine. Oh, I almost had it. Not fair. Alright, we're gonna try that again. I almost had it, but just broke free. And I don't trust myself to damage it enough without killing it. Oh, god damn it. Oh, boy. That would kill it, wouldn't it? I will kill it if I hit it. one was resilient as hell! It is born with the ability to defy gravity. It floats in air on powerful electromagnetic waves. You are one powerful little magnet, dude. Alright, enjoy being in Bill's PC. Alright. Jump down here. What's over here? Not much. Okay, there's the rock tunnel. That's where we gotta go, but there's a Pokemon Center here. 
Which is nice, and... Is there anything down here? Oh, there is. There's you. Which I do want to fight you. So we'll do that. I've been to a Pokemon gym a few times. But I lost each time. So you think you have a chance against me who has beat three Pokemon gym leaders? Your logic is weird, girl. Alright, Jigglypuff. Yeah, level 20 Jigglypuff, though. That's pretty good. I'm, I'm kind of surprised that you've been this lacking. Also, Jigglypuff is kind of terrifying with red eyes, by the way. Pound? Alright, well, I'm gonna bite you. The pound versus the bite. I think the bite is better. Defense curl. Now I'm gonna bite again. There we go. Uh, about to use Clefairy. Will I change? No, I'm not gonna change. Gyarados is amazing. Double slap! You are brave to be slapping a Gyarados. Imagine slapping that terrifying beast. Well, your bravery didn't get you that far, though. Oh, I feel it again. I can't even be a random kid. Yeah, sorry, girl. Alright. Well, I'm going to this uh, Pokemon Center that we just saw. Hi. I sold a useless nugget for 5,000 Pokedars. Hey, me too. I heard that ghost haunt Lavender Town. Yeah, and that's why people love Lavender Town, including me. The ultimate types of Pokemon make them stronger than some types and weaker than others. Yeah, I I got that. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We hear your Pokemon back to perfect health. Well, you do that then. Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. Oh, don't worry, you probably will. Well, actually, probably not. Once I go through Rock Tunnel, I don't think I'll be coming back to a round Pokemon uh, Center in the middle of nowhere. Alright, well, this is the way to Rock Tunnel, but we're going to be tackling the Rock Tunnel in the next episode. So, thank you, everybody, for joining me and coming to back to Pokemon Yellow. Hope you guys are enjoying this, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a nice day. Bye, everybody.